This update to Plotter is one that a lot of people have been waiting for. You can now color your scene cards. Let me show you how that works. So if you click into a card, you can see what color it is, and you can change the color. Let's give it a nice color there. And when you do, that card is now that color. Do that for another one here. Let's choose a nice blue there. And we'll give this last one, give this a green. But what these colors mean is totally up to you. It could be point of view. It could be an indication of what step it is in your writing process, or it could mean something else. But it's a very visual indication of whatever that is for you. And then if I want to remove the color, if I don't want one anymore, I just click that Remove Color button and save it, and then the color is gone. Another thing I want to show you is in the series view, you can now use templates. So if I click on there, I can choose, for example, the 12 chapter mystery formula. And right there it is. And I can just delete this one. Right there is the 12 chapter mystery formula in your series view. It's another thing that people have been asking for and now it's possible. The last thing I wanna say about this update is there's a new version of the mobile apps out that replaces the rich content editor with a new one that works great. And it works on Android, which is the biggest thing. So now you can add bold, italics, lists, headings, all the great things that you can add in the Plotter desktop app right here in the rich content editor in Android and iOS. There's also a lot of design tweaks in the mobile versions that make them a lot easier to use and a lot more clear what's happening. And they look a lot better. So that's it for this latest update to Plotter. Thank you, and more to come.